I studied visual communication at Tomasic Poly. Uh, this was from 1993 to 95. The first 10 years of my career, I was uh, really doing just graphic design, uh, what I learned in school. And then I worked in uh, advertising agencies. And soon after, I started my own practice asylum. The kind of projects that we started working on, um, a lot of it is really for the retail industry. Uh, for FMB industry and you know things that I, I really love and as I was designing the branding and the different visual aspects of it I felt that the space was really crucial to a brand's perspective so it's not really just you know the logo or the website uh, and hence from then onwards we started to look at a more holistic approach when it comes to design. Uh, one of the earliest projects that we started working on was a brand called Frolic and this is a frozen yogurt brand and as we were thinking of you know different directions of how we bring this brand to life uh, we looked at uh, visual cues and we looked at how the, the shop experience should be fun so uh, we took the opportunity of kind of looking at just purely graphic design to working on a more holistic approach in looking at interior design, looking at the digital experience. So from that small little project, we kind of you know, grew bolder and, uh, and then uh, slowly, I guess, we got more opportunity. Our biggest break was in Shanghai where we won the project to do Sony Gallery, which is a purely interior design project. We had not much of an experience, but we took on the challenge and we worked with an architect from America and we collaborated. Hence, we kind of learned hands-on uh, how do you work on a, a proper interior space. I guess designers today collaborate a lot more than the past because the projects tend to be multifaceted and they're just a lot more complicated. So you either uh, collaborate with uh, partners that you can work with or you expand your kind of team so that you can tackle uh, a lot more disciplines within one project. Uh, before I went on to the School of Design, I, was I, was I just wanted to design CD covers. I thought I love uh, music and I look at uh, album covers and I thought, wow, this is a great uh, career, I could do that. But going to the School of Design, I'm exposed to different disciplines like architecture, like photographers. It really opened up uh, a big door for me to explore. Uh, which is why I guess when I started uh, uh, my career, I did not want to be kind of, you know, uh, pigeonholed into a certain discipline or category. I get inspired by fashion designers, I get inspired by architects, I get inspired by, you know, artists. If you are 20 years old, you should just go and do whatever you want. You shouldn't be so fixated at what you learn. Rather, what you have learned is the foundation where you can really break free. Don't be afraid of failure, don't be afraid of changing, uh, just really explore. But I think once you find that love, then you know, dive right into it.